Hey everybody, how's it going? We're here at Lexus of Edmonton over on the pre-owned side and we're checking out this Acura here, Acura SUV, I believe it's the uh, MDX. It's got the turbocharged four-cylinder engine and the all-wheel drive. Gray exterior with the uh, kind of lighter gray tannish kind of interior. So we're going to jump inside here and start taking a look around at some of the options. Uh, first off, I want to point out it's very, very clean. It's been very well taken care of. Um, uh, it looks almost brand new in here, literally just about everywhere. I'm not noticing any little scuff marks or scratches or anything. It's been very well detailed after we got it and very well taken care of. Uh, so starting off here on the door panel, we do have driver's seat memory up there, power windows, locks and mirrors. Uh, power mirrors are right over here. And then you have power driver's seat with your back support there as well. Steering wheel is nicely leather wrapped the whole way around. You've also got paddle shifters on it if you want to have a little fun in sport mode. You've got Bluetooth controls, audio controls, cruise control right up here. You have the main navigation screen. It's also the backup camera. If we shift into reverse, you see that come on. And we've got all the controls for that right here to get around from the audio screens, the menu, the map, and the guides, and that kind of thing. Climate controls are right here. You've got dual temperature control, heated side mirrors as well, automatic climate function. Up top here we have uh, actually a little digital display for uh, the outside temperature, um, current climate settings in here. It's kind of difficult to see though the lighting's just not working out on the camera, but there is a little display right up there. And then we've also got uh, all your radio controls down here. It's MP3 uh, will work in this. You've got uh, CD player, auxiliary input, AM, FM, and XM satellite radio. You do have heated seats as well, right here and right here. And then you got drive and sport mode, uh, cup holders. You get a locking armrest, opens up like that. You get lots of room in there. You got the fresh manuals and everything as well. Uh, passenger seats not powered, just a manual passenger seat. And then we've got locking glove box, passenger door and window controls over there. Up top, you do get an auto dimming rear view mirror. Uh, it's got garage door openers right there as well. And then don't forget about your sunroof. So lots of stuff, very, very nicely equipped, I must say. Uh, so now we're going to go check out the rear seats and I'll pop the trunk as well. So here's our rear seating area. We do have window control right there. Uh, it's a single piece rubber floor mat back here. You have the center seat armrest as well. can pull this down for a little uh, couple cup holders there. And then you've also, you know, got the armrest itself. Uh, the leather looks great. Like these seats feel like nobody's even sat in them, to be honest with you. Like they're really, really well taken care of. And then we'll check out the trunk space. You get a lot of room back here. I was impressed. Uh, so you have the hard top cargo cover, and then you got all this space down here, and then this will pull up, and you got your spare tire under there, of course. Uh, and then these are your carpet floor mats. They're all freshly cleaned as well. And we'll just pull this back down now that we're all done there. And that's pretty much it. Uh, let's go take a quick look at the uh, odometer reading here. So we're at 52,658, that's not bad at all for this vehicle, and I'll just double check the year, I can't quite remember, we'll check this on here, uh, 2008, so 2008 with 52,000 kilometers on it, that's absolutely great, uh, really low for the year, we're talking almost 5 years old at, uh, or I think, yeah, definitely 5 years old at 2008 already, so you know, for it only have 50,000 kilometers on it, and the interior to be in the kind of shape that it's in is uh, incredible. Definitely worth coming to check out. So, if you have any more questions, give us a call, 466-8300, or drop by the dealership. We're at 170th Street and 111th Ave. And don't forget to go check out LexusofEdmonton.ca. Thanks so much for watching, everybody. I hope you enjoyed the video, and we'll see you next time.